Hi great mommies out there. So this video is all about how to be a responsive mom for your little one. Now let's get started. Firstly, after the school, every kid when they come home, they expect parents to speak with them. But it's really hard for any working parent who goes to office in the morning and they have a lot of pressure in there for the whole day and when they come back home, they literally need rest. So at that point of time, when child is asking some question, uh, parents will be so exhausted and even mom will be more exhausted because she is doing both households and office works. So at that time, she will not have energy to reply back to their kids. So that makes the kid more and more attention seeking and they tend to show their superpowers. So it is quite hard. It could be easily achieved if we slightly care about ourselves after office hours. So after office hour, it's a tendency like we have the mindset to go to the nursery, pick the child up and come to the home, rearrange things and cook, eat, sleep, right? So we don't really take a little time to actually boost up our energy. So once you're back from office, first you have it in your mind, you have to be energetic for that have some good food drinks or something and then go to the nursery just pick your kid and speak with your kid a lot spend at least one hour of time at least a day to your kid asking about their nursery about their experience with their friends and say about your own experience in your office though they won't totally understand it just try to speak with them and be a responsive mom so that your child will be more relaxed and they have already shared their experience with you in the heart. Children have the tendency of getting bored when they do the same task and again and again. So once you come into the home, when you talk to your kid for one hour, it is obvious like after one hour they will be so engaged and they used to do their work whatever they want because they have already spoken a lot with you and they will not have mindset to again come and disturb you and again shout hell and they will not show their superpowers so it is always good to have conversation with your kids so to have a good conversation you should be energetic to be energetic you should follow a proper diet after your office hours so having a good diet will result in a healthy life secondly while you do your conversation with your kid parallelly prepare some good foods which they like really and give them in a hot state so when they have it and when they hear your conversation they will really feel so happy and that day would be an amazing day for them so once they complete their dinner just engage them in whatever play activities they like some kids will like in doing the clay molding and some they like drawing pictures and some they like to do the collage so whatever they like just make them to engage in that so dedicate a room for them have those items in front of them try to make them so engaging and appreciate them whatever they do though they dust everything in their nursery for the whole day they will be definitely missing you so it's your time now after their school hours to engage them and appreciate them so they will have a pleasant sleep on that night now the very important third point never ever use gadgets in front of your kids because that makes them so angry because you are engaged with a different device not with your kid so try to avoid gadgets using in front of your kids if it is an important call it's obvious we need to attend but using whatsapp facebook and social networks in front of your kids will make their mindset to get get so frustrated so we need to really understand their feel. So by following these three tips, you could be definitely a responsive mom. You will not find any tantrums or any superpowers or any crying from your kid in their off school or just try out because I'm following the same strategy with my kid. I'm really finding a lot of difference in him. He is really, really productive nowadays. So if you like my video, share with other moms, whoever you know, and subscribe to my channel for all my future videos. 
catch you later in the next video thank you